from Balloon Utopia and Market with Balloons. I am here on the set at Fox LA and we are setting up some balloons for the Super Bowl segment. And this is a design that I've been wanting to teach you for a really long time and so I can't wait to show it to you. I've got to be a little quiet because the studio is right there and also it's very echoey. Okay, so I need this to last for a couple of days so we're high floating it. Normally I do them outside so we wouldn't high float it so it adds an extra layer of um, challenge to what we're doing today. But I've got some of the Hershey Kiss weights, um, you know, just like your normal weights. And then what we have here is we have our 12 inch linky balloons. And in this case, um, I am making uh, some Rams players. So we're going to use gold for his, uh, for the tights and then blue coming up for the body. So just let me smush my high float in there. And again, if you're doing this outside, you don't want to high float it, it's just going to be a one day design, but because they want to use it for two days, high float it is. All right, and then you're just going to inflate your linky. And we are really high ceiling, so I'm trying to be really careful not to let anything go. But then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to tie it to a, a little piece of 260 just like this, and then tie it onto the weight with the 260. Now I do this for two reasons. One, because this is gonna allow me to have a little bit more slack when I add the extra pieces to be the foot. Um, and two, if it, if it pops or anything, it's gonna be a lot easier to cut it off and tie a new one in, um, so I won't be stuck as much. So we're gonna do a chain of six, and um, And uh, basically, we're just going to tie one to the next one until the last balloon. Now, this design does require helium, um, otherwise it won't stand. So unfortunately, this is not a design that can be transferred to air, unless maybe if you're doing it really small. So this last one, oh, this one doesn't feel like it has high float in it at all. I don't know, maybe that went all the way down to the tip. All right. So now this last one, we want to do the same like we did with the first one, using the nozzle to tie it to the to the uh, weight. So this one, instead of instead of tying it directly to the, the one before, this one we're actually going to tie off and then tie it from the, from the nipple there. Okay, and then just like we did on the first one, we're going to take a little piece of a 260, tie it to the nozzle, and then tie that to the weight. Okay, so now we have his legs. Now we're gonna go up for the torso, and so we're gonna do two balloons for the torso. And this one, a lot of times it can be awkward, so I'll usually tie it first and then tie it in. So I usually wrap it around once, twice, and then tie nozzle to nozzle. Now this one is going to get tied right here so it kind of makes like a Y. Okay. And now 
down, they each get one more, and that's gonna be for the rest of the arms. And then we'll come back and I'll show you how we'll finish it in just a bit. Okay, so this is what we have for now, and you can see it's larger than life. And um, I'm gonna make a few more of these and then and then we'll come back in just a minute. Okay, so here's where we're at right now. And um, I'm just gonna blow this up real quick. This is a, a ram's head um, mylar balloon. And we'll be using this in just a minute, but so I'm just gonna blow it up real quick. Okay, and I'm just gonna put it onto a ribbon because like I said, I'm really worried about losing some balloons up in this very, very high ceiling there. Okay, now you stay. All right. So, I have here a bag of five inch balloons in duplets. And of course, you might remember that what we're gonna do is we're gonna take two duplets. A duplet is two balloons tied together. We're going to twist them together to make a quad. These are five inch balloons, fully inflated. And basically, we're gonna put the blue ones on blue and the gold ones on gold. And that's gonna hold it all nice and tight and make it not so like, you know? Now our gold ones. Okay, so now that we've done that, now I'm gonna come and get my 11 inch balloons. And they have two quads of 11 inch balloons inflated to about eight and a half inches each. Um, it doesn't really matter. This is just for the feet and also to give it a good footprint. You could do it in black. Um, I just chose to carry the, the colors of the pants through. So it's up to you, you know, if you wanna use the same color or different color. Anyways, we're gonna make a ball out of these, just like so, and then we're gonna flatten that ball. Now, the reason that we did that was because that makes a nice little pocket in there for the weight to go in. And then, we're gonna come down here, and this is why we have it on the 260, so we can just kind of stretch it and put it in there, just like that. Okay, so, that one, let's get this other guy here. then you can kind of give it a bend. So let's see, I wanted to kind of be throwing, so I guess I want one foot in front, and you can tell I'm a, I'm a very sportsy person, right? And one foot over here, like that, and then we'll put a football in his hand later. And then here I've got the football helmet, so I'm gonna tie this in up here.
can see these things are super gigantical, huge presents, they don't take that long, but they play huge. So that's it, if you like this, make sure you subscribe to my channel, make sure you like the video, make sure you leave me a comment, and of course, until next time, go forth and balloonify.